How's it going, everybody? I'm Nikki Delventhal, and this is my dog, Camper Delventhal. We lived in a Prius full time for three years, but now we're in a four x four Sprinter. And we're here to take you along on the wild ride. So fasten up your seat belts and let's have some fun. Don't forget, if you like what you see, like, subscribe, comment, share with your friends and turn on notifications. Camper and I would be so thankful. On last week's episode, Camper and I finally reveal our brand new custom-built home on wheels we've been saving and waiting for for so long. In true Camper and Nikki fashion, day one of moving in, Camper gets sprayed by a skunk. But we deal with that, and once we get all of our stuff into our new van, we give you a full tour of our 4x4 144 Sprinter van. It is truly a layout like no other. After the in-depth tour, we leave off going to see my sister Kayla nearby and taking e-bikes all around Portland for some fun and some shopping. Good morning, camper. <laughs> How's it going? It is sunny out, thank goodness. We've been staying in Portland all week to do last minute tweaks on the van because um, we just want to make sure it's perfect. So we've been putting up hooks. Uh, we added little fasteners onto different things. I actually ended up switching out the fridge 100% because I wanted a bigger freezer. So yeah, we officially have the perfect van and perfect weather to get us out of this little funk. Yeah, even with these dope bear pants and my brand new sexy van, uh, I found myself getting a little bit down. So I think we need to take our mobile home and move on to sunshine or maybe snow because we do really want to put this heat to the test. So, all right, let's get moving, camper. Whoop. We have been parked up at Dustin's cabin for a few days. It has been absolutely amazing. He's right on the river. Long-term goals, I could totally see myself in a home on a freshwater lake, a spring, big deep river. <laughs> but don't worry guys, we're kicking it in vehicles for quite a bit. This is where our heart is right now. What, are you scarier than a bear? Uh, yeah, I am. Look at me. I can take those guys out in three seconds. I still don't know where we're going today yet, but we're gonna go. <laughs> so back to the van. I do know we're gonna go pick up coffee on the way. Let's do that. Somebody's ready to go. Things are meant to be used, but like day one, how do we get things so dirty? We are, whew, life with a dog, I tell you. Camp, are you hungry? There he is. Oh, we had some condensation last night, Camptastic. We gotta crawl over everything because we made this entire van just for Camper. <laughs> right, Camp? This is all for you. And it is so hairy. Oh, you guys cannot see that. Hi there, can I get a half decaf, half regular latte? <laughs> All right, you guys, I could not show you that because that would get me some type of strike for sure on YouTube. Cheers. The people who are serving coffee <laughs> 
don't have shirts on. Apparently that is an Oregon thing. So yeah, if you want your coffee served by a topless woman, apparently that is something that they do here. Ready? All right, you guys, one hour and 30 minutes to our first destination and possible camp spot for the night. Well, that depends on how much snow there is, so. No drinking and driving, my dude. Oh. Fun fact, you guys, it is illegal to pump your own gas in Oregon unless it's diesel. So we're going to give that guy a break and do it ourselves. But isn't that cool? Yeah, I like it. We got a big booty gas tank too, so this is going to be expensive. Anti-gel, because where we're going it's going to be pretty cold. And uh, with the heating system we have, it's really important that those lines do not gel up. Have a great day! You too! Bye y'all! I love that. We make friends everywhere we go. Somebody's happy to be back on the road, huh? It feels a little counterproductive to leave the sunlight and head for the rain and snow. I think seasonal depression is a thing. <gasps> no way. Sunshine is medicine. This is proof. Your dog's reaction to rain. We made it to the snow park, which a uh, fun fact in many ski areas around the country, not just here in Oregon, you can park at select snow parks overnight. Um, you do need to check the snow park and the rules and you also may need a pass, which we got. Uh, we'll put that in the window in a second. Uh, but it is a really great option if you love skiing or you want to be at a trailhead like we are on your travels. Uh, it's really, really a great thing. So. If you got a snow park around you and you're looking for a place to sleep, might be a good option. Before we hit the trails, I need some fuel. First round of cleaning. All right guys, we're just doing a short one today. Um, although through snow, it usually feels like much, much more, but 1.5 miles round trip to a lake that we may or may not see due to snow cover, but at least we're getting moving. Looks like there's a lot of people out today. It's a Wednesday. Love to see that. <laughs> right into the snow. Nice, the snow is pretty packed down from all the mobiles. This is awesome. I love this, he is so happy. I don't know about you, but as a dog owner, I feel like anything that makes my dog happy, makes me happy. What a perfect day. You guys, this is so magical. It is snowing. Oh, we are in a winter wonderland. We made it to the lake. Woo! All right, camp, you ready to go back to the van? Maybe go for a little more walk? All right, let's do it. That was so good for the soul. 
I love being outside. While most people would go the path of least resistance, Camper loves some good resistance. <laughs> Honey, we're home. You made a friend camp? Oh, oh, camper, that is not your trailer. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna hang out in here. You guys have fun. <sighs> you guys, camper's having so much fun. We are definitely not stopping that. <sighs> what a cutie. Whew, it's hot out. Good boy. Oh. You love it up there. <laughs> I don't think you guys understand, unless you feel it, how good it is to just hang out in your van, door wide open, sun shining. There's literally nothing like it. <sighs> you know you still kind of smell like skunk, right? It's kind of a problem. It's 5.30 in the afternoon, and I am ready to put on pajamas and maybe turn on some uh netflix <gasps> yeah <laughs> my new van has a projector screen and smart projector whatever it is i don't know yay uh, that comfy camper i don't think we have enough room in here buy a bigger van sit in smaller places they say all right, guys, I do not feel like setting up the indoor shower, so uh, we're going to do things the old way here. Water and a washcloth. See you in a minute. Who's ready for movie night? Me! I'm not sure why, but I decided to make tonight's salad in a pan. Oh my god, my mushrooms froze. My mushrooms are on the ground. Cool. Cheers. Before we continue on today's adventure, a huge thank you to Bottle Bottle for sponsoring a portion of today's video. Now you guys might remember Bottle Bottle from some of my previous videos. Today I am going to introduce to you some new products by them. They have their 32 and 40 ounce water bottles. These babies are BPA free and dishwasher safe and come in a variety of colors. You can drink out of a straw if that's how you prefer, or you can open it up and just pour right out. But my favorite part is that the bottom here screws right off. Now, I personally have been using this as a place where a camper can drink water, but if you are someone who wants more purposes, like you have pills throughout the day, there is a pill and powder container. If you would like to purchase one of these bad boys for yourself, I will put a link in the description below where you can go to do that. And now, back on our fun adventures. How'd you sleep? Yeah, same. You guys, there was uh, <laughs> snowmobiles and trucks running through all last night. So uh, I would say one perk of a snow park near a ski resort is there's not like loud, loud noises. There's just people going to ski uh, through, you know, the morning when it's open and closed. Uh, but a snow park like this at a trailhead, <laughs> shoot, should have thought of this, I will have a lot of... <laughs> snowmobiles apparently at all hours and apparently this is a spot for trucks as well i'd never slept at this one before but there's a reason we were the only ones in the car park <laughs> that looked like a good stretch i think that's my cue to get out of bed yep okay maybe i'll try it camper style I'm gonna be honest, this is kind of weird when you go in that handstand, but it does kind of feel good. I feel like I'm like extending my back. 
This is not smart. <laughs> Uh, that was pretty silly, huh? Who wants coffee? Me! <laughs> Why is everything so hard? Oh yeah, here she goes. Last time I put this on something, it burned my favorite blanket, so we're not gonna do that again. You don't have a pour over, you don't need one. Camper, you wanna dance? We gotta do our morning dances. We gotta get in a good mood because we didn't sleep that good. Woo! He looks at me like I'm crazy. Look at this. We are not related. Remember that. All right, let's finish off this coffee. Protein, MCT oil, agave. Not too much. Vitamin D, milk. Is that good, Camper? Oh yeah, that's still good. <laughs> his eyes were popping out of his head. I think we're gonna have to give him some. It's goat, so it's actually Good for dog. <sighs> this is why I'm so energetic every morning. <laughs> that is definitely going back away just like that. All right, we are gonna head off on a little nature walk before we get out of here. Get the legs moving. <laughs> It's cold this morning. Camper, I'm gonna let you choose this morning. Which way do you wanna go, left or right? Which trail? The way we were yesterday? New trail. You choose. You ready? Camper, free. Go play. Where are we gonna go? Oh, you don't even want a trail, you want a stick. All right, fine, let's do it. I got you. <laughs> come and get it. <laughs> yeah, come on, you got it. Up. Yeah! Uh, this is what we call cultural enrichment. <laughs> and we're over the stick. <laughs> Time to keep moving. Are you kidding me? All right, we gotta take this for our way out and throw this out for someone. Clean up your trash, people. That's nasty. Not cool. Oh, this one's gonna be fun. There are a few things I love about winter, and this is one of them. I also love people who pack down trails for you, because this is amazing. I did this trail over the summer with my sister. If you want to see what that looks like, we'll link that video right here. It's beautiful, all seasons, that's for sure. Ooh. He has emerged from his hibernation. There's literally a garbage right here. <laughs> like clockwork. <laughs> on the road again. We're always on the road. What am I saying? Wow. I'm so glad I didn't make it. Why does everything fall? My cabinet's open. <laughs> Why can't I get this down? I can never just secure everything. 
<laughs> Darn. What else is on now? Oh, that's on too? Oh, God. You guys hear all these sounds? That's completely me being me. Okay. Now we're on the road. Gotta fix Buddha. Oh, Buddha dog. And to think she's the responsible one. All right, now we're on the road again. Woo! Camper, we made it to the coin showers. This, ladies and gentlemen, is why they invented toe socks. All right, just gonna do our best. Today we're gonna use a knife, we're not gonna use our mouth. Some of you are gonna be happy. Some of you are gonna think I'm absolutely insane. It's fine, it's fine. I don't know why I can't chop carrots like a normal human being. It's like a salad meets a rice dish, meets an act breakfast dish, meets a stir fry. It's a little too hot for your mouth. My mouth is burning off. Will you wait a second? Okay, now it's ready. You ready? Good boy! Bring it back! Come on! <laughs> Seriously? Go get the pine cone! Can you believe I used to live in those things? <laughs> Sometimes I can't. One, two, three, ba -na 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 -na. look so fine, yeah, I really want to make you mine. So if you look so fine, camper really want to make you mine. Little white boots, orange hair, waggy tail.